Let's have a go at this exam style question. The question says a scientist measures an athlete's oxygen consumption before and during a race. Figure one is a graph showing the oxygen consumption before and during the race. And then we have an image of a graph. Part A says describe what happens to the oxygen consumption in the section of the graph labelled B. And that's two marks. So let's begin by identifying the command word in this question. And I can see it here at the beginning of the sentence with the question, describe. In this question, because it's the word describe, you're being asked to give an account of the changes you see in the graph. Let's look at what other important information the question gives us. We are told that the scientist is measuring oxygen consumption. What's that? Well, oxygen consumption is how much oxygen the body is using for respiration in order to produce energy. Now let's have a closer look at the graph. Now we're told that the graph is showing the oxygen consumption before and during the race. And we've got time on the x-axis and we've got oxygen consumption on the y-axis. Now we can see in this first part of the graph, part A, the line here is level. And that's telling us that the oxygen consumption in this part of the graph is not changing. And therefore, that's likely to be when the race hasn't even begun and the athlete is at rest. So it's before the race. Whereas in part B, we can see the line suddenly increases up here and then it begins to level off. So this part of the graph is likely to be showing us the athlete's oxygen consumption during the race. So we now need to put a description into words for part B. So let's have a think at what sort of words we can use. I'm going to start by saying the oxygen consumption increases with time. It's good to use the word increase rather than goes up. It's more scientific. Increases with time. And then we can see around about here, it's starting to level off, isn't it? So that's what we also need to put into our answer to get the second mark. So I'm going to write until it reaches a maximum where it levels off. OK, so we've got two marks. The first mark would be to identify the fact that the oxygen consumption increases, shown in this part of the graph here. And then the second mark would be for saying that it, until it reaches a maximum where it levels off, which is actually shown in this part of the diagram of the graph here. So that's your second mark.